As Hurricane Helene devastated western North Carolina, it also pummeled Florida's Gulf Coast. With so many first responders from other states diverted to North Carolina, West Palm Beach Fire Chief Diana Maddie answered the call to serve in the Tampa Bay area. Activated by the state, Maddie's role liaison to the urban search and rescue team as well as firefighters in Pinellas County. My job for the week was to go to different emergency operations centers throughout the, the various counties through the region um, in the Tampa Bay area uh, and just see what their needs were as far as search and rescue or firefighting assistance. There was a lot of flooding so we brought in swift water rescue teams. There was a lot of building destruction from the storm surge so the search and rescue teams, the urban search and rescue teams went through, uh, searched the buildings on the barrier islands wherever the storm damage was. She gave an update during a report on MSNBC. Our mission when we first get here is to, you know, see where the heaviest hit areas are and see if there's anybody that needs to be rescued. And brief the public during Pinellas County news conferences like this one. As of yesterday, they searched 11,717 structures. There were 84 destroyed structures and there are over 4,000 that sustained major damage. Now back in West Palm Beach, Maddie expects to stay in town as we prepare for any impact from the quickly approaching Hurricane Milton. But she says there are firefighters on call to respond to other areas if they're needed. This is Cheryl Kahn reporting for WPB-TV.